Welcome, welcome, welcome back, Scrubs here, Scrub here, and we're back for an episode of the X and Y Pokemon Randomizer Soul Link with Inferno Man. What's going on? Hey guys, how how's it going? Uh, I might have just thrown my child just there because uh, I had no idea we were about to start rolling. You threw your but, what? Uh, my my son Trico here. Everybody on the uh, watching the video can see it. I, th yeah, I thought you said your child, up. and I was greatly confused. But he is my child. I thought I misheard. <laughs> I did not. But yeah, it's Pokemon time. Yeah. 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 So in the last episode, we 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 um Snorlaxed. We got that Snorlax. We got that out of the way. We fought Trudo. We had that double battle, which was. Eh. It wasn't, it wasn't that bad, to be honest. At least my side. My side was pretty chill. I mean, Trino kind of had a low blow with you if you uh, missed yeah. that. For, make sure to check that out <laughs> up in the card up top. But today, we're going to be traveling through this cave, getting a new encounter, which I'm excited for, and also hopefully getting to the next town to where we can like get to our next gym, Doofus. right? Yeah, we get a fishing rod. Oh, we actually do that? So we can start getting fishing encounters too if you want to do that <laughs> if you're about that um are you already <laughs> in the cave uh no I, i'm still on the bench oh there's two sections of the cave yeah i think we're supposed to go to the one by the bench yeah i think so too okay let's just go in then let's do this okay connecting cave Encou zubat roost my encounter is a shop it you already ran into something were you just running yeah yeah, I just I get I gotta shove it, which is great, cause yeah, shove it. I kind of dig this shup music. A great month. I can't hear the music because I have it <laughs> muted. <laughs> Whoa! I got a horde. It's your episode. You got a horde. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and I found the Pokemon I want. What is it? It's my favorite Pokemon. Uh, I'm I, I'm focusing on hitting the shove it here. I, I'm trying to to remember. Excuses. <laughs> just guess i'm trying to what, what do you think what do you think is my my hint my hint and it's a big hint i'm a gen oneer it, it can't okay well i i was gonna say snom but then i remember that's gen eight <laughs> snom um... was a good choice <laughs> snom might be my new favorite pokemon um you have three tries that was your first try okay uh charizard Ding, 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 ding. You got it. I did it first try. Let's I, go. No. <laughs> get out of here. No. I I actually thought you were going to uh, guess uh, Aegis Slash because I already mentioned that I kind of like that one. But yeah, no, Charizard. Charizard. So I'll, I'll from left to right, more for your sake of tournament since you can't see and the viewers can. Uh, from left to right, this is what I got on my screen. I got a Sunflora, a Stunky, a Houndoom, a Charizard and Floetta. So, yeah, I'm going for that Charizard. Oh man, Houndoom, no. giving me flashbacks. Don't worry, I'm <laughs> taking it out. Dragon Rage, it's out, it's dead. Okay, I'm risking it with the Leaf Tornado here because this thing has Insomnia and it's dead. No encounter. I failed. You killed it. Yeah. I tried to put it to sleep, but it has insomnia, and I was like, I gotta attack this with something, and I used Leaf Tornado, and it killed it. I'm not even gonna... I'm not even gonna kill the Charizard. I'm just gonna run away. It's not worth it. But we get an encounter right outside the cave, so it's not over yet. We're gonna get a couple encounters I could have gotten episode. my favorite <laughs> Pokemon. Well, you know what? You almost had my favorite Pokemon the last episode, and you killed it to make the spin to pair, so... You know what? We're even. If I if I believed in karma, I would say this was karma. I don't. Yeah, pretty much. I don't, so... Igly buff. I say, how dare this you? This turner has four. <laughs> Man. The Charizard is dead that, because of me. That was a big bummer. You know, I'm so used to playing Ultra Moon... Because, you know, that's that's my other thing. Yeah. And uh, this trainer was about to send out Raichu. And I was like, hmm, is it going to be Alolan or Kanto? And I was like, oh, wait, this is Kalos. Glad you, 
I'm glad you didn't say that like out loud. <laughs> it just sounded really <laughs> dumb. Like, what? What are you talking about? I'm very glad that the Raichu used qu uh, Quick Attack though, because it put Katsuki at 69 HP, which is nice. So dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Carnivine. Hmm. I'm going to use Rose for this one. Yeah. Makes sense. Uh, by the way, uh, we discussed this right before, but uh, Scrub has not watched the Nintendo Direct that happened today as we're recording this. You guys are going to see this an entire week afterwards. Okay, I got Carnivine mixed up with Carvana, and this thing is actually a grass type. I'm stupid. Uh, we're going to use Takedown. <laughs> Anyways, so we were, I was, I was hey, going to give before him... Before we talk oh. about the Direct, let's talk about that. When Because I literally just had that here too, where when you think it's a Pokemon, you're like, oh yeah, it's this Pokemon. But like, because the names are so similar and it's just, it's a different Pokemon. You're like, oh crap, I would have kept my Pokemon in if I knew that. Yeah, Carnivine Carvana is the biggest like, one for me because their names are like literally the yeah, same. Yeah, no, like I just had that just now with Florges. I don't even know who I thought it was, but I was like, oh, I'll be fine to say. And it's just like, oh, another grass <laughs> Pokemon. I was like, oh, not what I thought it was, but all right. But yeah, it's been great. It is a fairy type. It is. But it should be grass. She's finishing off with a purloin. Nice. Uh, so yeah, back to the direct. I'm basically going to give him a brief summary of everything that was important to me. Yes. Uh, because they're, they're just like directs all the time. There's always stuff that I'm not super interested in. I feel like that's that way for everybody. Nope. So I love basically, everything in directs. Every ounce of it. Every freaking second. Yeah. Okay, so we are supposed to go to the second one. We are supposed to go to the second path because it's blocked off and we need to, yeah. Alakazam could have been my encounter. I definitely wouldn't have killed that with a leap tornado. <laughs> I totally wouldn't have killed that on purpose. Oh, did I say that out loud? <laughs> I couldn't get- Oh my goodness. I couldn't get away from the Alakazam and that's Good. when I expected it to teleport, but it used Kinesis. It's it's not letting me get away. You are low. Okay, I guess I have my Spinda in the front. I don't know what the speed on Spinda is. Probably bad. Yeah, because I was gonna it's say drunk all the time. Probably trash. Okay, finally got away. Uh, I know you guys are on the edge of this, your seats to hear about the direct that already happened a week ago. Yeah, uh, but so we're not back, gonna talk about to, it. We're gonna keep talking back about to other what things. I was. <laughs> Back, back to what I was saying before I kept on interrupting myself rudely. Like, come on, me. I'm sorry, me. Yeah, how dare uh, you? Did you say, I'm sorry, me? <laughs> I'm sorry, me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> sorry. So, the direct started off great. I, I noticed right away Rex from Xenoblade. I was like, okay, is this a new Xenoblade game? And he was like, the, basically the gist of the trailer is that he was looking for Pyra. Uh, and and he's like, where the heck is Pyra? I yeah, guess Pyra's by that. standing there. He's a Twitter. Yeah. She, <laughs> She said, um, sorry, Rex, I had to hide this from you. And he, she turns around, she's holding the Smash invitation. She's like, cause I got invited to Smash. And it was like really cool. And then like, they revealed that Mithra is the other half of it. And like, they can shift into each other. Like you could with Sheik and Zelda and, and Brawl. And oh. my encounter for this grass is uh, Aromatisse, which isn't the greatest. Wait, wait, like wait, 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 wait. Are you already out of the cave? Yeah, I went around and then went all the way. You through. made it There's through no the cave. Oh my that. gosh! Is it like? <laughs> it's like one straight. I was gonna path, say, is it so is it the world's yeah. <laughs> shortest cave? Yeah, it's like the the shortest cave in Pokemon. I could have gotten a Bravery. It's not too bad. Bravery, yeah, yeah. that would have been great. Actually, okay, okay, okay. Since we're talking about like Rex and the the one chick, um, did you play? Uh, I can't even think of the game's net that game's name what Xenoblade? yeah have you did you play that one i wish uh i i mentioned this during my my reaction i said guys uh because i thought it was going to be like xenoblade 3 i said well when this game comes out uh we're gonna we're probably gonna be playing it on the channel and then she turns out the smash invitation i said never mind <laughs> but i'll probably get xenoblade 2 or whatever they have on the switch and I'll consider playing it sometime. You should. I I have it. I Oh, did I get another horde? Why am I just getting hordes? Wow. Well, this is like horde central. I know. I pr I, I still have my one honey and you should too. Yes. We we should have one left together. Yes. Um I'm going to put this thing to sleep so, now because okay. it does not have it. So, my experience with 
Xenoblade Chronicles is uh I was excited. I was so excited for when like to play this the game when it was first announced on Switch. Uh was I a Xenoblade fan? No, but I was excited to like see the series for the first time and I was very disappointed. Not that the game's bad, <laughs> but I was disappointed because of how the battle mechanic is. Um, because I, I love RPGs and whatnot. Actually, before before I continue this, um, I'll let me tell you, Infernal Man, what I got for my horde encounter. So from left to right, I have Prinape, Blaziken in Mega Form, Haunter, Pangoro, and Gulpin. Mm. So Pangoro sounds good. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go for the Gulpin. No, I, Interesting. I, I'm gonna go for the Blaziken. <laughs> I don't have a fire type, right? So it's like, couldn't. Yeah, I, yeah. I, oh, I have ketchup, but. Oh yeah, ketchup. I think I might still get Blaziken since it's mega formed, and it'll just be like power in the box because we're getting to the point where we're gonna have Pokemon in the PC. So. Yeah, uh, including this one because I don't want to use aromatis. That's that's fair. <laughs> um. So yeah, that's what I got. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So I love RPGs. That's my favorite thing. That's like why I'm hoping to do more in the future of this uh, this channel is more just RPGs in general instead of just Pokemon. But yeah, I was, I don't know. I was disappointed. I'm probably going to like do it as like a series on this channel to force myself to like experience the game because I heard it is a really good game. I don't know, man. I mean, I, I feel like you would like it. Yeah, yeah, probably. Uh, but, you know, I've definitely been in situations where, like that where I was like, oh, this game is going to be so great. And then, like, I actually find out what the mechanics of the game are. And I'm like, uh, I regret everything. It's like, <laughs> oh, this is not what I thought it was. All right. So first thing, I caught the Aromatisse. It was male. And uh, I named it Giovanni after uh, Giovanni from Fire Force because he's got, like, the Plague Doctor mask. Oh, nice. And, uh, so does Aromatisse, hey. uh, and I've been watching Fire Force recently. Hey, anime so. I haven't seen, I need to. Yes, you definitely should, it's a good one. Uh, and then this trainer that I ran into has a Suicune, which is not the greatest. Uh, I know it, it can learn Aurora Beam, so I'm very thankful that it used Rain Dance instead because I have uh, Rosé out to uh, combat the water typing. Cool. What do you think is a a good a good nickname for uh, <laughs> for for a uh, oh I can't even think of his name Blaziken a Mega Blaziken because like I want to name oh. this one Caesar it's like weird fire stings that's making me think of it but I don't know there's probably something else that's really good see a f fighting chicken. I think you should go with. You probably won't be able to fit it all, but uh, Magician's Red. Oh, or you can that's name a good Abdul. one. That's a really good yeah. one. Yes, another JoJo JoJo reference for those who haven't seen JoJo. But yes, that's that's a good one. There's an item over there, but I don't know how to get to it. So so I'm sad. it's Magician's Red, right? That's his yeah. uh, stand. Okay. Stand. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'll, I'll do it. I think that's a good one. I'll just do like mag, mag red. That's that's a good one. Let's see what else I could have gotten besides a Romatisse, a Glalie. That would have been better. I love Glalie. Just to clarify, I'm still Glalie's not done with this battle. Like I, I just, just got done with the other Pokemon. Oh, okay. That's the one thing with these horde battles is it's just like, it does take a bit longer. Oh man. Uh, by the way, guys, I'm trying to avoid. Oh, I kind of had toe to dial. Dang that would have been cool. <laughs> That's my. F yeah. Um, I'm trying to avoid as many battles as I can because while I did grind, that was a very purposeful thing. I don't want to be too over leveled for Grant. So, you know, I'm trying to avoid as many trainers as I can. So, uh, hopefully, I don't get uh, too many angry people for that. Like, why is Landon just going forward in the game? He's not even battling anybody. Trust me, battles battles are, are still going to happen this episode. You've you've already seen a few. Uh, there's another encounter we can get in the water. Don't listen to so, him. He's lying. Hold your horses. Don't. Ah, Blaze can stay in the ball. 
Abomasnow would have been great too, because you know, Abomasnow is a Pokemon I've used in a lock before. Um, he does have. There's another. I don't know, man. Like I've heard that Abomasnow sucks. I love it personally, but I've heard it sucks. So I'm torn. Um, it worked just fine for me in Heart Gold. So uh, whoever's been saying that is lying, or they're <laughs> they can into shove VGC. It. Yeah, I got another potion. Stay in the luxury. We're, luxury ball. Come on. We're the One, cool items. Two, three. Come on, stay in. Oh, the beautiful luxury ball. Nice. He just wanted to be like treated well. That's what it was. I was throwing him like great balls. He's like, nah, that's not gonna do it. You gotta, you gotta treat me king. better. I made it to Ambert Town, and Serena is coming. Hello, Serena. You're all the way already there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's talking about fossils and mega evolution, but I don't care. Uh, so, anyways, it, it's been a while, you know. You know, it's it's been a while uh, since we we mentioned uh, the direct. I, but, I uh, was just gonna say, since you're waiting for me, how about you talk about that direct while I try to catch up? Yeah, I'll, I'll sit in the Pokemon <laughs> Center. Just just let me know when you make it. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, <laughs> the 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 next cool thing, uh, well, I guess kind of cool. Like the announcement right after was uh, Fall Guys is coming to Switch. Oh, is it which really? Is like, yeah, okay. Yeah. I have not played that yet. I have it's not kinda, either, it's so it's kind of died it's down in popularity, but I'm still kind of all for it. Yeah, uh, I, I've definitely wanted to try it at least, it's, so I'll be interested It'll be in something I can use my Nintendo Switch Online for. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, yeah. Um, I might. There were, there were, I'm sorry, huh? but I might take a little bit. I am finding items. All right. Well, I'm that gives quick, me though. plenty of time. So uh, there were no Pokemon announcements, of course, because uh, they're gonna, wow, they're gonna have a direct about it, right? Probably their own well, Pokemon direct. Most likely. Okay. Uh, what, when you guys are watching this, if you're watching today, it comes out it's Sunday, so nothing definitely would have happened yet because I doubt they're gonna do anything on a Sunday. Uh, but yeah, guy, keep a hold. When my episode rolls around. Can't. When my episode rolls around, there might be. Who knows? You can't you can't taint that Sunday, that holy Sunday, with that gross demonic Pokemon game. <laughs> That's what it is. That's a sin. How dare they! <laughs> All right, continue. And oh, then, there's a trainer. Okay, continue. Dream big. Um. So, uh, th there. There was a bunch of stuff in between. Uh, I don't know if you're you're interested in this necessarily. Uh, well, there's a couple things. So there's a Mario Golf game coming to the Switch. Like a, uh, I can't a new remember one? the title. A new one or like a yeah, a brand a brand new one. I I don't know. It's got a story mode. I, I've had some good times with like Mario Tennis and Mario Golf in one of those games. So I might. The problem is I don't play any games on like off screen anymore. I don't have time. So it's more gonna be like oh. That'd be fun. I wish I could experience that, but oh well. How do you feel about it? I I actually think it's pretty exciting. I did like um the the Mario Tennis Aces they had, and this is kind of like the same style, but it's it's golf instead. Oh, it's got nice. the story mode and stuff like that. So uh, I'm I'm pretty excited about yeah, it. Yeah, but you know it's it's oh it's not like the 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 most exciting thing, but it it'll, it'll be cool. I could have gotten a turt wig. That would have been cute. Uh, that would have been but great. But Blaziken's too. probably the better choice. And Mega Blaziken. Yeah, yeah, Mega definitely. Uh, regular Blaziken, I would have taken a Torterra over Blaziken any day. Yeah, I, I like Torterra way more. So, what else do we mm -hmm. got in the direct? Uh, there. There was Metopia. Metopia's come to Switch. Gross. Which is cool because I never got to play that. Gross. Um, I'm opposite. Gross. Gross. <laughs> We need a, a me-based game on the Switch. I we guess. haven't had one yet. I don't know, man. I'm like the Grinch. I wouldn't. I wouldn't even <laughs> touch it with the thirty and a half foot pole. Perfect. That's me. That's me with the me stuff. Um, they they kind of uh, messed with us too because uh, they said. Recently, you know that we re released Super Mario 3D World on the Nintendo Switch with Bowser's Fury. And they're like, there's a, 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 a new adventure that, that we're planning right now. And I was like, okay, are we going to get a trailer for Odyssey 2 or something here? Mm -hmm. And they just, they just blue-balled us and went with another thing. <laughs> I was like, 
What happened to your announcement? Kind of, you just talked about a new Mario adventure and then left. It's kind of funny. <laughs> and, and they like moved to an Octopath game or something like that, like a sequel or something. Oh, to Octopath Traveler? I, I, yeah, I never got into Oh, that, so I'm going to be hyped for it. that. That one got me. Yeah, I, I, I think it was called Triangle Strategy or something like that. I don't, wow. I don't know, something with triangles. That's very <laughs> weird, but I'm pumped for it. Uh, yeah, no, I really enjoyed that game when that game came out. Um, hey, I finally made it to town. Hi there, neighbor. Don't talk to me. <laughs> She's coming. She's like, hello. She's like, we just had a battle that was like traumatizing with Tierno and Trevor, <laughs> but you know. That was fun, I'm right? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> um. Then uh, they 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 kind of started off with with Zelda stuff. Like we thought there was going to be a bunch of Zelda stuff because they they announced DLC coming for Age of Calamity, mm. uh, but they kind of left for a bit and came back uh, with the the director for most of the Zelda games. He came in. He's like, most of you might have seen me and expected an announcement for the sequel to Breath of the Wild. And yes. we're like, yeah, we yes. were. And he said, well, there's nothing about that right uh. now. And I literally said out loud, screw you, dude. <laughs> and then right after, right after he announced the HD remake for Skyward Sword. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, was yeah. Like, I saw that on Twitter <laughs> and I'm, I'm excited yeah. for that. I mean, because I said I, cause I never got to finish that game. I played it a little bit, like I barely got to touch it, but I never like finish it. And so I'm excited to play that. Yeah, me too. Uh, and they 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 also have some uh, Skyward Sword Joy Cons coming. Oh, weird. Also, where where are we supposed to go now that I actually caught up? Um. So. Um, fossils aren't happening yet. I don't think. Actually, I think I think yeah, we're supposed to go to the right. To the okay. right, fossils um, are, are over do here. We, I think. Do we want to touch our our blaze oh, our uh, new pair? Mind. Uh, or do you like look at it? Yeah, or like put it on the team. Do you not want to touch it? You don't want to add it right now. You want to just keep with what it's we cool got. That, it's cool that you got the Mesa, mega blaziken, but like I, I'm not really fond of aroma teas. No, that's fine. We could just like chill okay. off of it for now. I was gonna say like maybe we could replace the Spinda pair, but I was like, you know what? The hype for Spinda. I gotta keep it. To keep I it. gotta keep it. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. so apparently I, I was wrong about fossils. The scientist stopped me and he said uh, that the Rhyhorn are taking a break right now. So we gotta go north. Ugh, okay, fine. Yeah, I was honestly when I was first playing this, I was honestly a little bit confused at this point. Mind you. I'm pretty dumb when it comes to video games, so I get lost easily. I'm like, <laughs> like, where am I supposed to go? Pokemon, hold my hand. Yeah, it, it's a, it's a little confusing, a little back and forth stuff. I, I feel like we had to like talk to, to Serena about something or some, something like that. But no, I don't know. I got the, I got the fishing rod from the guy by the magic oh, card statue. Oh, I need to go I, talk I'm to him. Ready. So can we, yeah. can we, we could technically get two encounters, two more. Yeah, because if you we can get, if you go down, yeah. down to the left and then back, you it'll be considered the Amberit town. Yeah. Cool. So you want to try to get both encounters right now? Yeah, I'm gonna register my old rod so uh, in case it fails, I can I can do that. Oh, that's a good idea. That's the pro plays. We gotta be efficient here. We don't waste time here. Uh uh. Oh gosh. I reeled it in too slow. I pressed the A button right away, dude. <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, are you already fishing? At Amber. Oh, yeah. Which one? The Route 8 or the Amber Town? Amber Town and it's a wheezing. A wee wheezing. <laughs> Don't let it explode. Wheezing's actually kind of power. I know, like that's actually pretty cool. Like I'm I'm not against that, but don't let it explode. Oh yeah, I got. I gotta make sure that ah! I got Tatsumaki in the front. I reeled it in too you slow. Get? Oh, you reeled it in too ah! slow. Okay. <laughs> That's this I whole playthrough. Again, the game. You're too slow. Even the game's run again. It's like ha, you're too slow. All right, I got a frost last on my screen. That's nice. like not bad. Three shakes and a breakout. Stupid. Those hurt. Both? It's just using assurance right those, now. Those so. hurt on the inside. When it like shakes three times and then breaks, it's like, ah, oh, my heart. Yeah, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna put it to sleep. 
Are you? So A, it can explode if, if it has that, and B, so it can actually stay in the ball when I chuck one at its face. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Just like, accept my abuse and become my friend. Uh, so there, there, there's one more thing that uh, happened in the direct that was pretty exciting. Uh, they announced Splatoon 3. Oh, really? To end off. Nice. Yeah. It's, it's kind of like, um, oh, I wouldn't say Wild West thing. I think it's kind of like Mad Max Fury Road type of feel. Because it's like in a de desert and the Eiffel Tower is like upside down and in the ground. And apparently this takes place in Paris or the, the Splatoon version of Paris. And it, it's it's really like apocalypse look, looking like thing. It's, it's pretty cool. That's very weird. Yeah, and they, they revealed it, a, a new weapon. It's like a, a bow and arrow with ink oh, tied to it. That's so pretty cool. it's, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Um, I'm going to name this because I caught it. I just caught it. I'm going to name it Yokai Lady because I know this is based off of a Yokai. I don't know which one. I don't remember. But it's some ghost lady. So I'm just going to do Yokai Lady. I'm naming it Gus because I can't think of an anime reference because it's male and. Uh, I was gonna name it after Mina from My Hero Academia, but it, it's male, so that wouldn't work yeah. out. All right, cool. time for our other encounter. All right, let's do this. And then we'll probably end the episode off after that. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure out where to go, because I, I have no idea like what we're supposed you have to no do idea? to activate next. Well, you, you better figure it out. It's gonna be on your episode. Ah, oh, I really did it too slow. I'm not getting any bites. I'm gonna get a bite. Hey, there we go. As soon as I say it, <laughs> I jinxed it in a good way. Executor, returning from the horde that we had in the last episode. Fantastic. I don't like you. I'm like, just kidding. <laughs> Executor is all right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't like you. I actually like don't mind it too much in like Fire Red. When it's Gen 1 and there's not that many psychic types. That's when I kind of like yeah. it. Yeah. I. For my encounter, I have a bag on, so I'm I'm gonna finally get my uh, pseudo pseudo legendary. If you can catch it, <laughs> you think I can't catch it? Obviously, I'm gonna catch it. Oh, dang it! <laughs> okay, so that psychic was a crit, which means a non-crit psychic Rose will be able to survive. I why just want to put this thing to sleep. I was gonna say, why is Rose in there? Uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna use a potion. You scare me, you know that? I, I I'm a daredevil. I belong in the MCU. Not not with with Rose though. That's tied to fake. I like fake. Okay, even though it's not not a pseudo legendary, I still like it. So don't don't do that. Somebody needs to find out uh, what's wrong with my brain and why I keep on forgetting that. Sleep powder doesn't affect grass types. <laughs> I keep on forgetting that. <laughs> How dare you? And it put. I switched out to, to Primplup and Executor put Primplup to sleep. Oh gosh. <laughs> it's like, no. How about you feel sleep? I'm done switching out. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That's a water type. I was going to be like, I'm going to start chucking balls, but if the ball fails, then he's probably going to use a grass type move and I'm going to be dead uh, with Caesar. So, uh,. I, I literally have no idea. Oh, maybe I should switch out to my fire type. That makes sense. If I'm going to threaten it at all, I should probably switch out to my fire type. So, yeah, that's like one thing that sucks on my side is like I don't have any Pokemon that's like can put anything to sleep, paralyze or anything like that. Yeah, I, I, I just got kind of lucky, I guess. <laughs> but it doesn't matter because I can still catch Pokemon without it. I cut the bag on. Hey, I caught it without even attacking okay, it. Okay, well... What a waste of time. <laughs> <laughs> what a waste of time. I, I, I just realized both of my encounters were both, like, mediocre Gen 1 Pokemon. <laughs> I mean, that's fair. That's not... Okay, mediocre... Hey, man. <laughs> it's not that bad. Okay, so, uh, it's female executor i'm looking at my my hero academia poster right now and trying to see if there's a single character that that would resemble executor and i don't see anything like somebody might yell at me and be like how do you not think of this or how do you not think of this but like nope nope 
Uh, what? <laughs> I'm just gonna name it something random then. I, I'm Tree. I'm looking up mine. That's your name. Because this is where I've come to where I've decided if I if I can't think of like a specific nickname for it, I'm gonna like just go off of uh, Dragon Ball Z characters. Since that's my oh. favorite anime because I grew up with. So yeah. I don't have that advantage because I've never watched it. Well, you you got like other anime stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna talk to Serena while you do that so I can know exactly what okay we should oh we have to go to the fossil lab and talk to the scientist in there and then we can go get our fossils okay what? fossils coming in the next episode guys so yeah what <laughs> okay so cool I I thought I knew its name so I'm gonna I name it after uh Deborah because its last form is kind of like a demon Salamance is kind of I mean it's not really but, I don't know, it, it reminds me a little bit of Dabora. He's on screen right now. There we go. And, got it! Cool. Yes! Transfer the box. Nice. Oh yeah, and that's gonna do this today. So, next episode we're gonna, we're gonna figure out about those fossils. We're gonna do that, right? Yes, we are. Okay, that's a promise. You hear him. If he doesn't fulfill on it, um... Do hate comments. But on his videos, yes, lots of them. Every lots of, every lots video of comments on, on his stuff. comments say, um, <laughs> "You, you, how dare you?" Specifically that on all of his videos. I don't think I'm gonna be mentally okay after I get those. Yeah, you you have to do that after watching all of his videos. Like you have to wait till the video is all the way done and then comment. I mean, we still gotta be like polite, but you know. There you go. But that's it for today. I'm here, Scrub. Any last words? Any last words, Infirmin? Uh, yeah, um, so apparently when I put an object in front of my face cam, it, like, makes everything purple. That's kind of weird. But anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you, you like the, the, the video. I almost said like the like button. Like the like uh, button. Do it. <laughs> like it so much that you'll press it so that it turns blue. <laughs> and have a good rest of your day. All right, that's it for today. I'm here, Scrub, and with it, Furman, and keep on scrubbing.